destruction on an overwhelming scale. From above, you get a new perspective on Shijaiya, one of the areas worst affected by the latest Gaza conflict. Palestinian homes were bombed and battered by Israeli airstrikes and tank fire. Israeli troops fought militants here and targeted their tunnels. In this neighborhood alone, dozens of people were killed in the latest violence with Israel, and thousands more were left homeless. Now people are coming back, but you can see there's very little reconstruction that's going on. There are just a few bulldozers like this one to clear away all of the rubble, and there are no new building materials that are coming in. Israel has long imposed tight border restrictions on Gaza, saying they're needed for security. And since the ceasefire, nothing's changed. Aid agencies say a rethink is urgently needed. There would still be a housing crisis, even if Israel fully opened its one commercial crossing. While Gaza's calm, there's still no political solution to its underlying problems, and Palestinians here are now feeling them more acutely than ever.